my god, he's missing an eye. <gasps> Hey guys, it's me, Heather Chan, and today I'm back again with another Toriba prize unboxing. I have three boxes to unbox with you today, so why don't we get started? First box! In the first box, we only have one prize, and that is this Tibetan fox. This cute plushie is of a Tibetan sand fox. They have a very unique looking face that makes them kind of look disinterested in everything. And this guy's actually sitting down on his little butt. He's super soft. Look at that cute tail. And let's see, let's look at what his tag looks like. There's the Tibetan fox there on your right. And on your left is the stork. And here on the front of the tag, you see them sitting at a bus stop bench together. He's a rather large plushie. He's so very cute. I love his face. How can you not? And I'm very happy that I was able to win him in very few tries on a ping pong machine on my birthday. And on to the second box. In this box, we actually have five prizes. So let me open the smallest prizes first. First up is this cute white axolotl pencil bag. Have you ever seen an axolotl with teeth? Well, now you have. The zipper on this thing is ridiculously huge. <laughs> oh my god, I can't stop laughing. Look at that. That is scary. If axolotls had teeth, can you even imagine? <laughs> nom, 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 nom. This is actually designed by J Dream. On the tag here, don't know if you can see, but it says it's actually designed by J Dream. And I actually have some squishies that they designed of axolotls. So this cute little guy here was designed by the same company as this. <laughs> I'm having way too much fun with this. Somebody stop me. So let's see how deep it actually goes. I don't think it actually goes all the way down to the tail. So when I put my hand in here, it actually goes around this far. So yeah, it should be able to hold a few pens and pencils. And it also has this cute clip. Terrifying, but cute. I had to have it. And this is what, and this is what the tag looks like. The drawing looks a lot cuter than the actual design, but I still love it. This zipper, I don't know how many of you guys cosplay or are familiar with cosplay, but this zipper reminds me of those giant zippers on the Kingdom Hearts cosplays that you see. I've never actually seen one of them in real life. And well, now I own one and it's on an axolotl. <laughs> Next up, is another axolotl pin bag, but this one is pink. And this one also has a white zipper. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, look at, oh my god. I can't stop laughing, because axolotls don't have teeth, but if they did, it would be terrifying. And this one actually comes with a cute pink Lip. Very soft material. I forgot to mention that about the first one, but the material is very soft. And the eyes are actually, I thought they were solid black, but it actually has a brown ring around it, which kind of makes it even creepier if you ask me. Anyway, I think it's adorable despite its huge teeth and it is going with the rest of my axolotls in my collection. Next up in this box, a slowpoke plushie! This guy is actually way bigger than I thought he was gonna be. I mean, they did say it was a large plushie, but sometimes their translation or their definition of big and large or huge is sometimes skewed, because sometimes I've gotten a plushie that says it's huge and it's actually only medium-sized, and plushies that I got that said were big were actually really huge, so... I love Slowpoke. He is one of my favorite Pokemon. Of course, as you can tell, most of my favorite Pokemon are from the first generation of Pokemon because those are the ones I grew up with in middle school. And I actually cosplayed this guy too a couple years ago. He's very big and like I said in my previous video of all the Pokemon plush that I unboxed last time, it's not very soft like the Axolotl plushies and the Tibetan Fox plushie over here. He's kind of got a rough texture. There's his big old belly. I love his cute little feet. And there's his cute little tail. And in this house, we do not eat Slowpoke tail. Slowpoke are our friends. Next prize in this box, a giant axolotl plushie that is smushed beyond belief. Oh my God, it looks like roadkill. Let's free it from its plastic prison. Oh, he's all wrinkly from being vacuum sealed. Like the 
axolotl pen cases that I showed earlier. These guys are also designed by the company JDream. He's got brown and black eyes. There's the tag. Very cute and floppy and soft. He's not stretchy like the other axolotl plushies I've opened in my previous videos, but oh man, he'd make a very perfect fluffy soft pillow. And the last plush in the second box is another giant axolotl. And like the other guy, this guy's pretty wrinkled from being in that vacuum sealed package. But I love this pink one, so cute, matches my room. Like the other one has the black and brown eyes. I love that the little fin part of the tail goes all the way around, unlike the other axolotl plushies I've unboxed in the past. The legs look a little bit wonky, but I can look past that. And here is the tag, the same as the white axolotl that we just looked at. So very cute, and I'm always happy to welcome more axolotls into my collection. And now we are down to our last and final box. First prize we have in this box is this cute axolotl pass case. Oh my god, he only has one eye. <laughs> this is the first defective plush I've gotten from Toriba. I guess I'm just gonna have to make him an eyeball out of felt and glue two felt eyeballs on his face. <laughs> it's kind of cute just with one eyeball though. You can tell where it was supposed to be, strangely enough. So anyway, this is a cute little pass case that you can hook to your bag or your pants to use the bus or the train. And also, you can hold coins inside. It's also a little coin purse. It's made out of a very soft fabric and he's stretchy. And this is where you would put your bus pass or your train pass. I don't know if you guys remember from my previous video, but this guy actually matches another axolotl plush that I've unboxed. Well, despite only having one eye. I love this guy and I'm very happy to add him to my growing collection of axolotls. Next up in this box, we have another axolotl plushie and this one is a pen case. Unlike the previous one we just saw, this one actually has both of its eyes. It's got a cute gold ball chain keychain at the end of the zipper and on the inside, it's got a cute silky lining. The fabric is the same fabric as the other two plushies that I just showed you, very soft and stretchy. Long axolotl is long. He's got a lotl body. I'm horrible, I know. I'm having too much fun today. Next up in this box is this Kobe Lakuma plushie. She's actually really big. I actually won her out of a ping pong machine in one shot with a free play ticket. And it was insane because nobody had played that machine yet and my ball landed in the correct spot on the very first try. So let's take a closer look at her. She's got her cute little red button, her cute white belly, the bottoms of her feet are pink. There's a little tail. Cute little pink paw pads up here too. And that adorable face. And the last prize in this last box is a cinnamon roll plushie. This cinnamon roll plushie is really cute and I won it in only two tries. All I had to do was stab the head down twice with the claw and he was mine. Look at the cute blush details on the face there. It's got this cute little necklace that says, and you, so it's like cinnamon roll and you. The cute little cinnamon bun tail, and the tag is so cute too because it's like pastel and it has a bunch of different Sanrio characters on it, like Kuromi, Pom Pom Pudin, Hello Kitty, and My Melody. It also has this special tag on it with the same characters. Very cute, very soft and this one is gonna be a keeper for me as well. And here are all the prizes that we unboxed today. Well, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Subscribe if you'd like to see more, and I'll see you next time. Bye!